New at 5 o'clock, an Army veteran suffering from PTSD finds relief in a natural yet somewhat controversial substance. And now he wants to offer that same option to others in our area, opening a CBD shop in Baytown. Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers is joining us live from Baytown with more on his story. Brittany. Uh, Bill and Lauren, when I got the chance to speak to this veteran, he tells me that prescription medication for his anxiety, depression, and PTSD just simply didn't work. And so in three days, he's going to be opening the doors to his store, selling what he says did work, CBD. David Cuff served in the military for 10 years with deployments in Korea and Afghanistan. But he says his personal battle began when he returned home. Being in, we were, had a duty to do when we got out. We out of the military, we really, really didn't have that mission anymore. So anxiety hit, depression hit, our PTSD really hit. Prescription medication didn't work for him, but this CBD oil no, did. My anxiety has been gone. Um, my depression is relieving. He's turned his remedy into a business. In three days, the Army veteran will open CBD Med in Baytown. CBD, or cannabis oil, is from the cannabis plant, but extracted from hemp, not marijuana, which means no THC. So you don't get the psychedelic feeling. You don't get the high no high, but touted as a treatment for a wide range of ailments from anxiety to inflammation. And here in Baytown, you might find many forms like gummies or even bath bombs. We have chocolates, lozenges. The natural but somewhat controversial CBD business is one of many popping up around the area. The Food and Drug Administration only backs the claims that CBD may help with some types of epilepsy and all other health claims are under investigation. This new business owner says it isn't for everyone, but it changed his life. It's kind of personal to me because I'm able to keep pushing because I have a product to help me out with um, the depression and anxiety. Now, all across the country right now, lawmakers are still wavering on this particular issue. Places like New York and Ohio are taking a closer look at CBD. Meanwhile, here in Texas, this particular shop will be opening up on Saturday. Live in Baytown, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News.